Hey guys, Dave here. This is the Trojan War uh, from Metagaming. This is Meta History number two. This is actually the second one of these I have. I already have uh, a copy that I've already played. I was going through my stuff looking for things I no longer needed to sell and raise a little bit of money. So I came across this. Let's take a look and see what's inside. Well, let's look at the back first. Can you still stand with the heroes of Troy, the bloody struggles of Greeks and Trojans before the walls of Troy inspired an age? Homer's Iliad immortalized Hector, Achilles, Ajax, and Helen, whose love launched war. Now you refight the siege of Troy, you stand with those legendary heroes, you relive the drama that inspired courage for three millennia. So let's take a look inside. Says level, average complexity for two players, that's accurate. Uh, playability, scenarios play in an hour and a half to four hours of rapid action. And components, 240 play counters, a 17 by 22 map, and a rules booklet. Looks like this copy's unpunched. Well, it includes a little dice too, I've forgotten about that. That's good. And hmm, the old address for metagaming, they're not there anymore. Let's take a look at the rule book. So it's from 1981. Oh, it has a little index in the front cover. That's always a good idea. Let's see how many pages it is. If I recall correctly, it wasn't particularly complicated. Oh, it's got a photocopy of the counters here trojan greek am i missing oh, oh it's two-sided it's got both there good i got worried for a second there i was missing some of the counters so doesn't have page numbers so it's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten 11, 12, 13, 14. Alright, so it starts with an introduction saying it's a two player game, going over the counters and what they mean. And preparation for play and then sequence of play. First player turn, uh, rally, stunned, and panic uh, combat results can be removed. Movement, combat, and then joint replacement, uh, both players take replacements if any. And then second player turn, rally, movement, combat, and joint uh, replacement again. It's going over movement now, combat procedure, rallying, replacing units. And here's the effects from the combat results. But where's the combat result table? I don't remember. Intervening of the gods and then victory points, awarding victory points for killing a hero, wounding a hero, killing a wounded hero, killing a capture, uh, capturing a killed hero. Interesting. Yeah, it's been a while since I played this. And it's got some scenarios here. Short battle from the Iliad, book 8. Battle at the ships from the Iliad, book 11. The Vengeance of Achilles from the Iliad book 20 and then then came the Amazon from Quintus Miranius book 1 and the death of Achilles from Quintus and Hercules grandson from Quintus I can't even pronounce that and I'm going to try and the second battle at the ships from Quintus Smyrnanius or whatever the hell his name is and the triumph of Neopotelemus from Quintus Smianius. And the bow of Philoctes. And the topless towers. And now it's talking about the campaign game. So there's a lot of scenarios in here. That's good. Oh, here's the combat results table. From what I remember playing this, let's take a look at the counters. For the 1980s, those, uh, let me zoom in a little bit. Those counters ain't bad. I remember uh, throughout most of the game you're putting uh, panic and stun counters on uh, troops and wounded counters and so forth. And here's the other army. 
and you can heal and stuff. Forget about that. Looks like you got chariots. It's been a while since I played it, but the game wasn't bad. I just got tired of putting the, the, the damn uh, negative one counters and stuff on the uh, different units, if I recall correctly. Let's take a look at the map. Okay, one sec here. This is folded up weird. So this is a very simple map, Greek Seawall and Troy. And then show some ships down here and over here, what's this stuff here? Oh, victory points to keep track of down there. And then the game turns. Um, yeah, it was an all right game when I played it. Uh, problem is I don't need two copies of this, so this copy I'm just going to sell. But anyhow, I wanted to show you guys what the game looked like before I put it up for sale. Thanks for watching, and if you liked the video, please click like on the video. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to this channel. And as always, have a good evening.